eat homemade and stay healthy hi everyone welcome to homemade if you haven't subscribed to my channel consider to subscribe and do not forget to hit the bell icon have you ever imagined cabbage in a curry if not then let's make some cabbage roast today the coconut milk paste curry and a vegetarian recipe as well for this recipe i'm going to use around 250 grams of cabbage it's a half of a cabbage and i'm going to trim the ends and chop the cabbage in big chunks do not chop it finely or shred the cabbage once you have chopped the cabbage in a bowl take water add the cabbage pieces along with some salt and keep it aside next in a mixer grinder jar add around 1 cup of freshly grated coconut 3 to 4 garlic cloves 2 teaspoon of coriander seeds half a teaspoon of cumin seeds half a teaspoon of peppercorns and half teaspoon of turmeric powder along with 2 cups of water grind it to a fine paste with the help of a strainer underneath a bowl pour the grounder mixture press and squeeze to extract some thick coconut milk once you press and squeeze the mixture should be dry and you get a thick coconut milk keep it aside add the dry coconut mixture into the mixer grinder jar along with 1 cup of water and extract the thin coconut milk the same way and keep it aside finally chop one medium size onion and tomato Slit some green chilies according to your taste. I have taken two. Next, in a wide deep pan with one tablespoon of coconut oil, add half a teaspoon of mustard seeds and few curry leaves, along with chopped onion. Sauté the onion till translucent. Add the tomato and green chilies. Cover it and cook the tomato till mushy. Once the tomatoes are mushy, add the cabbage pieces. Mix it and cover it. and let the cabbage cook in the steam in between just give it a stir so that it doesn't stick at the bottom repeat this process till the cabbage is around 60 to 70 percent cooked at this stage add the thin coconut milk mix it and for seasoning you can add the salt or a vegetable stock cube mix it again cover it and let it cook around 2 to 3 minutes After 2 to 3 minutes open the lid add the thick coconut milk and give it a quick mix to balance the taste add around 1/4 teaspoon of sugar and mix it once you have added the thick coconut milk just when the curry is about to get a boil put off the flame and enjoy as the curry sits on the room temperature it will become thick if you try this recipe let me know your feedback bye bye god bless